G'day guys, welcome to our masterclass for this week. It's David from Be Skill Be Fit. We're gonna do our footy passing. So make sure you grab a drink bottle, gonna go to the van, grab some gear, and then we'll get started. Set up a couple of goals, so you might not have a goal, but you might be able to set up a target as we did with our soccer. Use the fence, or use the back of the garage, or use the brick wall. Make sure you check with your parents, so your adults at home. And got a few of the recycling bottles, some of the cones, some of the old odd socks, some of the socks. If you don't have a footy, you can even practice passing with some socks if you don't have a footy. So. You can always do that, that's no problem at all. So, with our footy, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set up a target to start with. So, I'm gonna pass from my right side to my left side. Now, I'm right-handed, so we're gonna start on our good side, but we're gonna learn to do both, and we're gonna practice doing both, because it's really important that you can pass both ways in a game of touch footy, or in a game of footy, or when you're just fucking around with your mates. So, we're gonna start with the target on my left side, so I'm going to pass from my right hip across my body towards the goal. So we're just going to aim for the target. Okay, so what we want to do is hold the ball straight out in front on the fat part of the ball and put it down to my hip. Okay, so we're going to pass across my body. All right, so remember when we did our throwing, our step is really important. Same when we're doing our footy passing. So I'm going to step. I'm going to step towards where I want to pass. I'm now looking at where I want to pass and my hands are going from my hip straight across my body towards our target. So the point of the ball is aiming towards the target and my hands are going to finish pointing towards the target. Okay, so hands on the fat part down to our hip. Okay, remember holding it both hands, we're not just grabbing it with one hand. Still got both hands on the ball, on my hip. I'm gonna step, I'm looking at my target. And my hands finish pointing towards the target. Let's go again. Hands on the fat part, down to my hip. I'm gonna step, I'm looking. Okay, remember my hands are pointing towards my target. Okay, let's go with the socks. Okay, let's pretend the socks is a footy. Down to my hip, step, and pass. Remember my hands are pointing to my target. Let's go with the recycle bottle. Hands on the sides, down to my hip. So you, if you don't have a footy, grab your socks. Grab your sock, recycle bottles. You can practice with any of those things. Now, we wanna be able to pass different distances. So move yourself further away from your target. Move yourself in a little bit closer if you're not quite making the distance. That's okay, it's practice, it's building it up. Remember, we wanna push with both hands, okay? And make sure our eyes are on the target. Make sure our hands finish pointing towards the target. Okay, so let's do that again, and this time we'll move a little bit further away. All right, so, in this one, we've just moved a little bit further back. I've got a couple of footies, a couple of recycle bottles, a couple of uh, socks. Okay, so remember we're gonna pick the ball up, okay, from our hip. If I'm picking it up off the ground, we wanna try and pass from nice and low. That saves a whole lot of time coming up and then passing. So if it's down on the ground, we wanna do this nice and fast. Pick it up with both hands to my hip, step, and remember our hands pointing towards the goal. Let's go with the recycle bottle. Down low. Remember our hands pointing towards our target. Let's go with the socks. Whoa, the socks are a bit hard to get all that way. Recycle bottle. Okay, and the socks again. So remember a step, make sure we're stepping towards our target and our hands finish towards our target. And the footy. All right. So that's 
passing from our right side across to our left side, but remember at the start we said we're gonna be able to pass both ways. So let's set it up and we're gonna pass at the other goal and go from our left hip across our body, passing the other way. All right, so I've got the goal over to my right side this time. Okay, so ball out in front, we're gonna to go to my left hip. Sometimes it can be a little bit of middle, but that's okay. Remember we're gonna hold with both hands. We don't then just tuck it under our arm. We're not running with it. Okay, we're gonna pass it so we need it in both hands down to our hip. Okay, so this time I'm gonna step with my right foot towards the target. Remember, eyes towards the target. And I'm going from my left hip across my body towards the target. Remember, hands again have got to face finish pointing towards our target. Okay, so hands on the fat part, down to my hip, remember both hands on the ball. I'm gonna step, eyes on the target, and hands go across our body. Let's go with the recycle bottle. Hands on the bottle, down to my hip, step, and pass. Remember hands pointing towards our target. The socks, step, remember toe pointing towards our target, on our hip, pass across our body, footy, down to my hip, step, across my body, the socks, hands on the socks, down to my hip, point the toe towards the target, hands pointing towards the target once we let go of the ball. Okay, so got to practice both sides. We don't know which way we're going to have to pass it. So might be running. Remember we want to run with two hands on the ball so we can quickly pass that way, quick, quickly pass that way. If we're running with one hand, most of the time people are going to realise you're going to pass that way because it's hard to offload that way and pass out that way if you've got it in one hand. So remember, run with it in two hands. We can pass to our left. We can pass, whoop, we can pass to my left. We can pass to my right. Okay, so this time I'm going to set it up and I'm going to pass both ways. Okay, I'm going to go left, and I'm going to go right, I'm going to go left, I'm going to right, and I'm going to keep changing which way I'm going. Remember, if it's down on the ground, we want to stay nice and low when we're letting it go, otherwise we waste time coming up. If it's a pass that someone's passed to me, then we can just step and pass and let it go. So I'm going to set it up, put our things in the middle, and I'm going to be passing both ways. Okay, so for this drill, I've got my goals on each side. You might be able to set up two different targets. You start back up with the witches hats, run in, remember down low, pass across my body, run back, and we're going to do that as we're moving. Okay, so we're going to go to our left first, then I'll come back, and then I'll go to my right. We're going to use the socks, the recycle bottles, and the footies. Okay, off we go. Okay, this one, we're gonna make it a little bit harder. This time, as I come in, I've still got my goals to the left and to the right. I'm gonna get a voice called to me whether to pass to the left or the right as I come in and pick it up. Left. Left. Right. 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 Left. Okay, so as you come in at that last minute, you can quickly swap those feet. Bring it up to your hip. And go across your body. So try that one out, that's a little bit more tricky. Okay, I'm gonna move those things back and then go on to our next step. Okay, so I've just grabbed our things back in the middle. Now, if you've got someone who can come out and play 
with the footy pass in with you or can help you. What you can do, they can be a couple of metres away from you and you can actually just walk passing to each other. Remember we want to try and pass backwards, so when you're with the ball, you've got to go a little bit quicker to get in front, so you can just walk across your area, passing, turn around, come back, stay on the same side so you get to pass left side and right side, and then as you're comfortable with that and confident with that, then you can start jogging, okay, and then build up your speed and start running faster and faster, okay, and pass left side, right side, but you need a friend that can play that with you. All right, now, one final thing before we go. When we're passing, if you want to spiral, spin the ball, we're just gonna show you what you need to do with your hands. So, hands on the fat part, down on my hip. Remember, we step, everything stays exactly the same. As I pass, I bring my right hand up. So I'm gonna roll the ball that way. Okay, so hand comes over the top and that's what makes the ball spin, okay? So not using my left hand, when I'm passing from my right hip across my body, it is my right hand doing the spinning, okay? Right hand comes up. Do it with the recycle bottles, okay? Right hand comes up. stays the same, our step, where our hands finish, okay, socks, remember my right hand comes over the top, so I'm going to grab those and then we'll do it going to our left side, okay, so a spiral to our left, hands on the side, go down to our left hip, remember we step, and this time it's my left hand doing all the work. Okay, I'm not spinning it away from my body, it spins towards my body, so my left hand pulls up over the ball. Remember, hands point to where our target is. Hands come across, my left hand is coming up over the ball. Remember, fingers pointing where we want it to go. Over the socks. Remember, the left hand coming up over the top. slow motion and right down for you so you can see the action as it comes out of our hands. be able to add uh, our passing drill in with our kicking drills as well and you can merge the two and do some kicking and passing at the same time and simulate the game situation. So have fun with it, keep practicing, get better and better at your skills. At your skills. Just before we go, our quick joke for this week. What sort of room doesn't have any doors? A mushroom. See you next time.